Well, yeah, how y'all doing? All right, they, we are up to snuff. Uh, we got our lung capacity up. Let's go do this mission. Amphibious assault. Completely useless. Um, set of requirements. Because in my humble opinion, um, I believe you could complete the mission with the default lung capacity. I don't know why they make you jump through hoops to get your lung capacity up like that. How many of you out there think the same? With your default lung capacity, you can easily complete this mission. You don't really have to swim that far. I don't get it. It's not really that far. It's not like you have to swim underwater for like 30 seconds. I think maybe even 10 seconds would be the max. Anyways, we'll see. Here we go. Got my lung capacity up. Let's take a look at this. I did it the hard way, no cheats. Player. There we go, so lung capacity, and as I discussed last video, um, it doesn't have to be 50%. As you can see, mine is clearly, uh, how do you make it stop there? Stop, yeah, there we go. Wait, 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 back here, wait, wait, yeah, wait. Yeah, as you can see, mine is about, I'd say about 35%. Rough estimate, okay, is well below 50%, okay? So, the wiki is dead wrong, as you'll see in a moment. Hold on, you trying to tell me you can't swim? Seriously, when I'm in the deep water, it, it panics me. Plus, I'm terrified of eels and squid and seaweed and... Okay, dude, see, I know you're just trying to make excuses now. Look, CJ, I need someone from outside the triad who I can trust. All right, so let me get this straight. You want me to swim around in dirty dock water Dodging little brown jelly beans and Vietnamese gangsters to put a bug on a boat in the harbor? You're so negative. Listen, man. When I was a kid, swimming off the Santa Maria, I once got a condom stuck to my face. <laughs> Hard like that stays with you for life. Believe that. <laughs> confession to make. I, um... I'm blind. No shit! Yeah. Although I've trained my other senses to a point where you wouldn't notice my handicap, in the water, they'd be quite useless. All right, Woozy, relax. Don't beat yourself up about it. Look, I'll do it. Uh... One last thing. You do know that I'm black, right? And not Chinese. I'm blind, Carl, not stupid. Now, how did he know that? He could be like, you know, Kid Rock or something like that, you know? He just talked to talk, but he's white. <laughs> okay, here we go. Um, this mission, okay. It wasn't this mission that made me realize this. That let's just see where we have to go first of all. Actually, there's a couple missions to go. I started to realize, hey, wait a minute. There's a little bit too much hand holding going on here sometimes, because they give you the impression. Okay, some missions there's there's real tight set of rules of engagement. We really have to follow them closely. Follow the train, you know. Don't spook this guy, etc., etc. But other missions, yeah. Um. They spoon feed you these objectives as you go along, and you're under the impression that you have to follow them to the letter, uh, but you don't have to all the time. And sometimes there's a lot easier way to do things. You know, you know, you only really need to know what's the bottom line. How and why will I fail this mission? And um, this mission is a perfect example. You know, when you get out there in the water and you start swimming around. They may think, you know, you may think, okay, don't get spotted, stay underwater, etc., etc. But you don't have to do that. The only thing that can fail the mission is if you die. That's it. Otherwise, I mean, um, other than that, you can pretty much approach this any way you want. So the objectives that they spoon feed you, you know, kind of mislead you into taking doing things the hard way. And I've noticed that with this game. So, a little too much hand-holding sometimes going on there. 
Okay, let's do the same. Basically, we've got to follow the the little blips there. Swim into the red blip, swim to the tanker and get aboard. That's your only task. That is your only task. Ignore everything else. Here you definitely have to swim underwater. Now this is what I'm talking about. I believe that you could make this swim with the default lung capacity. Easily. Come on, am I right? That's nothing. That's nothing. It's a little longer one coming up ahead. Prepare for it. Dive down. Squiggle through there, come on. Maybe to make up for the game's uh, inability to. <laughs> Very well. Here's that. And the final one. Wait to catch my breath. Have a sip of coffee. Up you go. Surface. Yeah, you could easily do that. Post Gamma, what do you think? You could easily do that with the default lung capacity. Easily. Don't swim on the surface or the Okay, so here's what I'm talking about, okay? Let's just take a look at the brief. Okay. The main route across the water is guarded by two patrol boats. If they spot you dive underwater to lose their attention. Okay. You could do that. You could do that. Don't swim on the surface of the water or you will be spotted, okay? So basically, the game's trying to like, you know, you see all that training that you did with lung capacity, this is where it's gonna come in handy. But this is the freaking hard way to do things. You're not gonna die or then you're not gonna fail the mission if they spot you. The only thing you have to do is stay alive. If they spot you, they start shooting at you. Basically, that's it. That's the only thing you have to worry about is staying alive. So what I do is... Anybody? We got he was just here. Swim for that island. He's on the surface again. He's got to come up for air at some point. Shit, must have been a seal. Get up on the island. Get down here. Watch. Hunker down. Put on your sniper rifle. Blow these guys away. Point blank. Shit, over there. Some guy in the water. There. The threat has been eliminated. That's it. You don't have to swim underwater and, you know, hold your breath and stay out of the way. You know, fuck, fuck that. And you know what else to get you? <laughs> Shoot at the searchlights. <laughs> yeah, boy, yeah, who's your daddy? Now, all you have to do is get out to the boat. Now, there's one more patrol boat out there. You can see it way off through the distance there. That's not it. That one right there. Can make things a little easier by sniping him. And that's it. Let's make a swim for it. And there's a spotlight I forgot. That's okay. Now, the way you get on the boat is on the other side. You could swim underneath the boat. Maybe here's where your lung capacity would come in handy. Get up here, and that's it. Put on your silence 9mm. You gotta silence 9mm, right? Doesn't matter. They'll, they'll feed you a knife once you get in there. Here's a knife. So if you don't have a silence 9mm, here's a knife. And now we're gonna stealth our way around. First guy's always got his back to you. 
There's another guy up there patrolling. Stealth on. Here's where I really wish you didn't have to do the combat roll. Just kind of slide it. And up here we go. To the back. in here. More guys downstairs to so watch out. Our objective is right there. Usually I like to take out the guys that over there first. I think you have to actually. And if you get busted, just plow into them with a silence 9mm. It'll take them out. No problem at all. There's one guy and one more guy over here. And there he is. Come to Papa. I've been to prison. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? <laughs> and that's it. Everybody's dead. Let's plant the bug. And all we have to do is just get out the boat. Retrace our steps. Up the stairs, Carl. Whoa, get me up the stairs, fool! Okay. <laughs> there we go. And there's our destination. There's the last boat that we didn't really uh, take out everybody on. Oh no, we did. Okay. So that's that. Let's go for a little swim. And you can see our objective marker way off in the distance there. And um, sometimes they drop some napalm on you. That's when you have to swim underwater. <laughs> I'm kidding. They don't drop an A for money. <laughs> and you're home free. And that's the easy way to do this mission. So. $11,000 and more respect. Yeah. So don't get too hung up on that whole lung capacity thing and trying to swim underwater and all that crap. It's a little bit, uh, I'd say, much ado about nothing. And conveniently enough, we're right near some free body armor, so you might as well grab it. Think. We're done. Let's jack a vehicle and get on back to the garage. Call it a video. So, what do you think about that, CJ? I can't believe you pulled that out, fool! You there. Give it up. You're going to make a donation to the Kingdom of Slack. Thank you very much. Um, and here we go again. Seems like you can't steal an automobile without having the local law enforcement chasing it around. What kind of town is this? level that's wonderful yeah 
Hey, I want to thank you all very much for watching. Yeah. And I haven't done this in a while. If you thought this video was remotely entertaining, hey, don't forget to give it a little slack story. Thumbs up. Uh, yeah. All right. That's it. I'm out of here.